guys. <clears throat> this is my attempt at doing the constellation, the Ursa Major, or Ursa Major, sorry. Um, yeah, I know, my art is, eh. But, this is one of the animals that are forever featured in the heavens. It is one of the 48 constellations listed by Ptolemy in the 2nd century, but we are going to go past that and learn more about the Great Bear. It is the third largest constellation. It contains 22 named stars. The constellation is visible throughout the year in most parts of the Northern Hemisphere, and believe it or not, this is one of the oldest constellations known to mankind. It is mentioned in both the Bible and also by Homer, um, and not Homer Simpson, the guy that wrote the Odyssey. Zeus fell in love with a nymph called Callisto, and together they had a son named Arcus. I hope I pronounced that right. However, like always, Hera, Zeus's wife, got upset and found out found out about the whole thing, and she turned Callisto into a bear. For years, Callisto managed to stay away from hunters until one day, father or er, until one day, mother and son found each other in the forest. The son drew his spear and was ready to kill his mother, because he didn't recognize her in the form of a bear. Zeus decided, I need to save these guys, and so he put them into the heavens. Arcus, the herdsman, and Callisto as Ursa Major. Fun fact, its bright star forms part of the Big Dipper. So if you look, here's the handle of the Big Dipper, and down, and there is the Big Dipper. You have the head of the bear, the tail of the bear, the legs of the bear. And with that, I'm going to let you go.